Here we go. First submission by Reb. This is a alternate universe version of Milky Chan as Link versus Doc Milky Chan. If you guys don't know, Milky Chan is our channel's mascot. She's a cute anime girl with the milk pin, and she is our, uh, she's like our, like I said, our channel mascot. And it's super cute. And also, when Reb submitted this, she said that she had put an Easter egg in there. And for the life of me, I could not find the Easter egg for the longest time. But when I was getting all of the art ready for uh, tonight's segment, I saw it. So, if you guys want to know what I'm talking about, if you zoom in, Zoom in a little bit more, actually. If you zoom in a lot, and if you actually look at Milky Chan's shield, I suck. Uh, the Hylian shield design is the Milky Finishers. It's a TMF. So TMF standing for the Milky Finishers. I saw the F first and then backtraced it and saw the, the M and that the symbol was supposed to be a T. So it's so cool. And uh, Milky Chan has a Milky Finisher Hylian Shield. And I love that Easter egg. So cool. And I almost missed it. Too bad Nintendo fucked up this scene on Nintendo Switch Online, but we're not going to talk about that. Um, but I love it. Uh, I love her eyes. I love the Master Sword. And I love Dark Milky Chan. Uh, maybe... Dark Milky Chan will show up at some point in the future as well. We don't know. Thank you, though, Pop. You just brought up a good point. I should be having music in the background. Thank you. Just give me... Uh... Let me give me one second, actually. One second... This is a perfect fan art segment song. I use this song a lot when we do fan art, but it just, it's very relaxing and it fits. So screw it. I'm going to also turn it down a bit because we don't need it that loud for background music. Okay. So awesome submission by Reb for the fan art contest. Now, not all of the art submitted tonight is for the contest. I'll be going over the winners at the end. So that submission was by Reb. Awesome. Super awesome. Love it. Okay. Next submission by... Taters! This is uh, Marie from Splatoon, but it's, what was this? Sanitized Marie? Something I have never heard of until just yesterday, but it, she looks really cool. And I have not streamed Splatoon in a while. I would really like to, especially before Splatoon 3 comes out. But, as you guys know, Sanitized Marie, that's what it was. Um, as you guys may or may not know, Marie is a character in our Metopia playthrough. And if you guys have not been watching our Metopia playthrough, it is amazing. And we're actually going to be continuing it this week. Uh, either tomorrow or Tuesday, we're going to finally be continuing Season 3 of Metopia. And Marie is trapped in the darkness. This is what she's going to look like by the time we save her. Super cute. I love her. Uh, Marie's my favorite squid girl. And amazing submission. And I can't wait to see her again in Metopia. Amazing colors. Awesome submission by Taters. Uh, speaking of Marie, we have a back-to-back -back Marie cameo. You don't see that very often. This is a submission by Alea Kazam. And this is some of our favorite Milky Finisher girls. You got the Bomb Chew Girl. You got Princess Rosalina. And you got Marie from Splatoon yet again. And look at that. The Bomb Chew Girl is holding a glass of milk. How amazing. Awesome stuff from Alea Kazam, and if you've ever joined our Discord, that is our welcome banner, and I love it. Awesome submission. And they're at the beach. Uh, even though it's starting to be a little bit colder out, we did just pass through summer, and this was a, this was a summer memory. The pictures you look at fondly. So awesome submission by Alea. Awesome stuff. All right. Uh, moving on, we have a submission by Rainbow Kappa. This is uh, an alternate universe where Pop did not run over the kids while watching the Milky Finishers. So he decided to not watch the Milky Finishers that day, and he didn't run over all the helpless kids and kill them all. So that's pretty cool. It's pretty good. Nice. It's always good when kids are not ran over. Thanks, Rainbow Kappa. All right. Up next is a submission by Marco Tribe. This is uh, a sketch, and this is supposed to be me, um, but wearing some of the cursed wish stuff. So let's zoom in and kind of analyze this a bit. There's a lot going on in this. So that's me 
I'm wearing the creepy face mask, um, the Among Us beanie, the Master Sword. I've got the Kim Jong Un Mona Lisa shirt. <laughs> What's that in my pocket? The Jesus thing? I don't remember the Jesus thing. It looks like a Pop Tart. I don't know what that is. Uh, I got the Milky Finisher belt. And then we also have Morshu as a fairy, as Navi. Morshu as Navi is so cursed, but I love it. Super cool. And, uh, very, very awesome by Marco Tribe. Very awesome. And it's kind of similar to Reb Submission of Chat 2.0. Uh, but I like it. I, I like it. Good stuff. Awesome, awesome submission. Oh, it's the Jesus is Calling shirt. That's what it is. I have it under my arm. Gotcha. That's what it is. That's what it was. I blocked out a lot of the, the Wish stuff. That was cursed. All right. Um, up next is... Another submission by Alea Kazam. And this is an OC of a Gerudo from The Legend of Zelda. Um, according to Alea, this OC Gerudo's name is Ruby. And I like her outfit. Um, the Gerudo are really cool. And I think in Breath of the Wild they were done quite a lot of justice. So let's zoom in and look at some of these details. Um, I love the earrings. I love the, uh, I guess you'd call it the breastplate. The Ruby in the middle. Her hairstyle. And uh, yeah, very, very cool. And I would definitely, she would definitely not be out of place in Breath of the Wild. So, awesome stuff. I like all the jewelry around her legs and everything. Super cool. Super cool. So, another amazing Zelda-themed submission by Alea. Alright. Um, up next is a submission by Reb. This is an alternate universe where Mario... Fights Bowser so many times that Bowser has become Sans. This is <laughs> Milky Finisher Mario versus Sans Bowser. <laughs> this is so cursed, but I fucking love it. Um, it I, all the shit that we've ever seen in our stream, I mean, this this is it. I mean, you got Sans, you got Mario, you got Bowser, you got all kinds of shit. And Mario's wearing the Milky Finisher glasses. Absolutely perfect. Um... Yes, the, these, these, there's so many amazing submissions. No matter what, chat, uh, everybody that submitted art for this segment, you guys are amazing. All of you guys deserve so much, and I'm just so happy. These segments are because of you guys. Like, you guys make these segments amazing, and I hope that you guys uh, enjoy them and keep submitting art. Even if you don't win in the contest, it's not about skill. It's not about who's better than who. It's about coming together, having a great time, and looking at some awesome freaking art. And uh, I love looking at all of it. It's, so, it's such a fun time. So please, please always submit art contest or not. Uh, but that was good. Great one. All right. Up next is another submission by Marco Tribe. And this one is fucking cursed. Chat, you're not ready for this one. This one's rough. I need a sip of water before I go to this next submission. Next submission by Marco Tribe. Here we go. This is an alternate universe Milky Chan, where Milky Chan is like a big fat slob. Oh, all right, let's uh, let's dissect this. So that's me and Milky Chan on the couch, and it says, "You know what? The moles from Skyward Sword ain't that bad." And then Epic Man's mom says, "Zach, it's time to play Mario 64 for another 800 hours." And Epic Man's mom is just a big, fat monster. Um, also, uh, Mario 64 is on a CRTV. That's pretty cool. You have the uh, supersonic plush on the ground. And what I think is Majora's Mask. Majora's Mask on another TV. So you have Mario 64, you have Majora's Mask. And in the window, it wouldn't be a Milky Finisher stream without... Sans? Here comes Sans. And Sans like, Midna has nipples, buddy. <laughs> So, this one is so fucking cursed. Um, about a year and a half ago, we had a fan art contest. And it was the cringe contest. And it was, who can make fan art that makes me cringe the most? If this would have been submitted, this would have been easiest number one. And I'm not even saying that because, like, the art is actually amazing. The references, the coloring, the art, the details, phenomenal. But in terms of just pure shock value, this would have easily won the cringe contest. This is uh, 10 out of 10. I, it's it's insane. Um, it, it provokes a lot of emotions. You're pissed that Marco got your mom's hair right? 
<laughs> Epic man's mom, dude. We finally got to see her. It was worth the wait. Worth the wait. Thank you, Marco. Or maybe don't thank you, but thank you for real. All right. Up next is... Submission by Taters! This is uh, Milky Chan as an inkling from Splatoon. It's so cute. And if you guys are super hardcore fans, you'll realize that this is a uh, revision of a uh, piece of art that was submitted by her quite a long time ago, over a year ago now. And it's uh, inkling Milky Chan. She's got the hairpin, she's got the thigh high socks with the glasses. And uh, again, more Splatoon art is always welcome. Super amazing. And I love the pose, and I love, like, the tongue out stuff. And, uh, super cute! I love the outfit, and here's a little detail, too. If you look at her shirt, it also says the Milky Finisher. It's got the Milky Finisher brand blue t-shirt. Love it! Super, super cute, and I love all the shading. Um, really good! Really, really good, and it makes me excited for Splatoon, as always. So, shout out to Taters for that amazing submission. All right, a couple more pieces of art for tonight's segment. You guys went absolutely ham with submissions. Uh, I love it. Thank you. Thank you. Um, we have another submission by Alea Kazam, who drew uh, just the bomb chew girl. Uh, but it's like, she she's a little more thick than I remember. Damn, dude. This is uh, <laughs> definitely <laughs> definitely. Uh, Interesting version of Bob True Girl, but I like it. I, uh, I'm totally down. Love the colors, love the hair, love the cute eyes, and I love the sheen. Uh, super cute, and I love it. So, big shout outs to Alea Kazam for the other piece of art, and for just a standalone Bomb True Girl. You can never have enough, Jet. Fun fact, our, um, very first fan art contest was the Bomb True Girl. Years ago, that was our very first fan art contest of all time. Hold up, I gotta take a sip of my smoothie real quick. But awesome art by Alea. Yeah, really good job on the hands and everything, too. And lastly, for uh, non-video related art, we have another submission from Reb. And this one is Super Idol with the Milky Finishers merch. He's got the Mario hat, he's got the Milky Chan at the beach shirt, and he's got the mug. What do you what do you think about this super idol? Super idol 的笑容，都没你的甜，八月九五的阳光，都没你耀眼。热爱一百零五度的你，滴滴青春的蒸馏水。<laughs> super amazing, super idol amazing. Ah,、uh, submission from Red. Damn, could you imagine if Super Idol actually watched our streams? That's how I know I'd made it. If, if Super Idol actually watched my streams, I'd be like, you know what? I finally made it as a live streamer. That's it. I've peaked.、Uh, but amazing submission. But before we、uh, go, we also have a couple of video fan art submissions. We have two, two video fan art submissions from the green screen streams. Um, a couple of them got lost, so be sure if you want your green screen highlights to be shown during fan art, please, please, please post them in the fan art section. A couple of you guys posted them in like media share or chat, which is fine, but it made them harder for me to find because a lot of you guys talk in those um sections. So if you made one and I missed it, just repost it in the fan art section, okay? But we do have at least two from the green screen stream now. If you don't know. Uh, for September, I did a stream where I did a bunch of skits and said a bunch of things in front of a green screen. I uploaded it to our YouTube channel and told you guys to download it and make whatever memes that you wanted. So please continue to do so, and I will show those off every fan art segment as well. So the green screen video is live on YouTube, ready to be downloaded for you guys.、Um, so let's jump on into those, okay? So first video submission. Uh, I actually don't re I'll don't remember who made the second one. So if you made the second one, please let me know and I will give you credit. But the first green screen submission for fan art tonight was made by Dally Dilly in the chat, one of our moderators. So here we go. This was all him. Check it out. Wrong、uh, thing. Now check it out. Sorry. Hold up. Sorry. Let me just get it ready. Here we go. Oh. 
This is where Andrew's been the whole time. Hey, dude. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> Absolute perfect. Holy shit, that's good. That's a good meme, dude. That's that's the type of creativity I'm expecting. Dally and, and is setting the bar high. So make sure you guys download those green screen videos. Continue to make edits. I'll keep showing those off every fan art section. Uh, we got one more, though. We got one more. Uh, we got a shorter one here. And then, uh, yeah, so here... I don't know who submitted this one, so sorry. This is by Anonymous. Close that shit. What the hell is wrong with you? Hold up. It was actually not fitting correctly. There we go. One more time. Close that shit. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> there we go. All right. And with that, that is our fan art segment of the week. If you're watching the stream and uh, you were like, hey, Zach, I'd like to draw something or make a green screen edit. How do I make sure I get my art shown on the stream? All you have to do is... Uh, First, make some art, whether it's digital, hand-drawn, and email it to us at themilkyfinishers at gmail.com. Or, if you're in our Discord server, post it in the fan art section, and it will be shown off every single Sunday at the two-hour mark. Okay? Any questions, feel free to ask me or a moderator. If somebody could do the Discord command. Oh, thank you, Dally. And you can submit your stuff there.